Hello everybody, and welcome to our new podcast called The Compass the Gaming. And today we'll be talking about the Five Nights at Freddy's movie. So for the trailer, it looks like it's going to be a good movie. Yeah, especially if you guys saw in the trailer, they changed um, Springtrap's eyes from red to white. They still do have the red eyes in other animatronics, but of course they have white for Springtrap, and and everyone was getting mad about that. So that's good about the movie too. Mm-hmm. So how the Super Mario Bros. movie went, and I think a lot of people liked it. it I mean, it was the it was the best-selling movie of course, uh, with money and that stuff. But the but the games are turning into more movies. Yes, more games are turning into more movies, which mo- means it's because Mario was made like in the '80s, so people are older from the playing so a lot so older people bought the movie which leads into Five Nights at Freddy's since it was a horror game you had to be like 10 or older to buy it and it released in 2014 so that means people are probably like 18 now that because it's it was made in 2014 so if it's eight years old and people have to be 10 or older have it, it's 18 or older so that means 18 or older people will be going to see this movie which means it, it's more money and there's going to be three uh, two other movies but this first one is the first one so that means there'll, there'll be three movies so people have been asking if it's going to be a PG-13 movie or a rated R movie from the trailer it looks like it's going to be a PG-13 movie some people are saying people made fun of Jason Blum for trying to make this a movie well this is obviously going to be very popular, especially around Halloween, because it's coming out October 27th. So, yeah. So this this was was our first episode episode of Compass of Game. Goodbye! Make sure to subscribe and like.